Hey, what's up? Jigzer here. Have you encountered the device unavailable notice on your iPhone after multiple unsuccessful attempts to unlock it? Luckily, it's pretty easy to reset your forgotten iPhone passcode without even connecting it to your computer. In this video, I will walk you through each step to reset your passcode and regain access to your iPhone. Let's go. If you want to regain access to your iPhone without plugging it into a computer, there are a few things you need to remember so that the method I will discuss later will work for you. First, your iPhone must be running iOS 15.2 or newer version. And most importantly, you need to own the iPhone and have it signed in with your Apple ID. Otherwise, you'll be stuck in the activation lock screen and won't be able to restore your device. In case you don't have access to your iCloud password, you can use our YouTube search to find the solution to your problem. To start removing your device passcode, enter it incorrectly a few times until the lock screen shows unavailable with an option to reset your iPhone. When you enter an incorrect password four times, you can try again after one minute. Once the minute is up, provide a wrong passcode again and repeat the process until your iPhone is security locked for 15 minutes. As soon as the 15 minute wait is over, Enter a wrong passcode so that the screen finally displays the Erase iPhone button in the lower left corner. Note that if you choose to erase your iPhone, the device will completely be restored to factory defaults. But don't worry, if you've backed up to iTunes or your iCloud account, you can easily restore any data to your device. To confirm the reset, please enter your Apple ID password. Upon successful validation, your iPhone will initiate a reset and automatically restart when the process is complete. To avoid interrupting the reset process, be sure to plug in your device to a power source, especially if the battery is low. When your iPhone reboots and you see the Hello screen, swipe up and select the default language you want to set for your device. Next, choose your country of origin from the available list. If you have your current iPhone or iPad, you can use the Quick Start feature to automatically transfer data to the iPhone you're setting up. But if you don't have one, click Set Up Manually and follow the on-screen instructions to continue. Connect to an available Wi-Fi network nearby so you can easily restore your device over the internet later, especially if you have an existing backup on your iCloud account. Then wait a few minutes while Apple activates your iPhone and follow any on-screen prompts. Setting up your Face ID is optional at this point. You can always set it up later in your settings. On the other hand, creating a new device passcode is mandatory, so enter your new passcode and re-enter it to confirm. On the next screen, choose how you want to transfer data to your iPhone. You can restore it from your iCloud backup, restore from your Mac or PC if you have a copy from the Finder or iTunes, transfer directly from another iPhone, or move data from an Android device. If you are setting up your iPhone for the first time and don't have an iCloud account, select Don't Transfer Apps and Data instead. Next, set up your Apple Pay, or you can skip this step. You can also configure it later in Settings. When your iPhone reboots, unlock the screen and enter the new passcode you created earlier to access your device. In case this process doesn't work for you, another alternative is to unlock your iPhone with iMyPhone Lock Wiper. To know more about this solution, check out my channel for more information. Okay, if I've been able to help you, I'd appreciate a thumbs up and a subscription. If something didn't work out and you're stuck, check the comments. Maybe someone has solved the problem. Otherwise, I can try and help you further. I offer personal support on Fiverr and can give you independent advice. I also offer many other services. Feel free to check them out. You'll find the link in the video description. Until next time, bye.